You are able to export an MBS Create outline specification directly from a Revit model. This feature will work if you have used objects from the MBS National BIM Library or if you have associated objects in your model with an MBS Create system or product clause or clauses from your library of Office Masters. To export the specification, select the New MBS Create Specification button from the MBS tab on the ribbon. A warning window displays. This indicates that for any object containing an MBS Type ID property, the value will either be deleted or overwritten when the specification is created. Select Yes to continue. Next, you need to select a suitable file location and enter a file name. The specification file is created and the relevant clauses are downloaded. If any of the objects in the model are associated with product clauses, you can select a parent system to link the product clause to. For instance, this mirror clause can be linked to a sanitary accessory system. I will select Continue. This window indicates that the NBS Create specification file has been created. All of the objects that are now associated with a system of product clauses are listed. Note that the association is between object types and specification clauses. So there may be 13 instances of door objects in the model, but as there are only two types of doors, an external and an internal, just two types of door set system are added to the model, type A and type B. Below the total associated objects group, the warnings group displays any objects with an MBS description value that does not match the clause title in MBS Create. These objects can be updated and renamed at a later stage by using the Verify Associations report. The Errors group displays any clauses that have not been automatically added to the specification. You are able to manually add these. Note that by selecting the title of any object in this window, you are able to highlight the object in the active view. If I select Edit in MBS Create, it will allow me to log in, view and edit the specification clauses. You can view and export an outline specification. From here you can add general descriptions for each system or information that might inform the next stage of the design. From this point I can open each system and add more detailed specification information in line with the development of the model.